today i would like to discuss about total commitment to the aim which is a must have you heard of columbus his aim was to find a western route to india this aim backed by his zeal and daring to undertake independent ventures made him succeed benjamin disraeli wanted to become a great lawyer after some failures he lost interest in becoming a lawyer then he wanted to become rich by buying and selling shares in the stock market again he shifted his interest and wanted to become a successful journalist when he failed in journalism he wanted to write literature and become a great author like sir walter scott he did succeed in this aim to some extent but by then he wanted to be the prime minister of great britain and shape the destiny of his country he was fascinated by the aim and deeply desired its achievement once when his wife taunted him he is said to have replied but darling you forget you are the wife of the future prime minister of great britain wasn't that self confidence at that time he was not even a member of parliament after losing many an election disraeli finally did become a member of the british parliament when he got up to say his first few words in parliament he was ridiculed most members of the house burst out laughing some of them shouted sit down sit down benjamin disraeli did sit down but before doing so he said in a firm voice i will sit down now but the time will come when you will hear me out of course they did listen to him later and for quite some years he became the prime minister of great britain for two terms michael angelo the great italian sculptor and painter one day was looking at a rock with fascination and wonder in his eyes what are you looking at asked a bystander a beautiful piece of sculpture replied michael angelo at this answer of his the people around began to doubt his sanity but soon michael angelo carved out of that rock a beautiful piece of sculpture yes if your aim is strong you can see its fruit before your mental eye long before it comes true whether an aim is induced in you because of your contact with a strong personality or because of an insult or because you found out what you would like to do better than anything else the effect will be the same it will magnetize your personality therefore everyone should imp- realize the importance of aim